We did it. We ruined the internet. Yes, more than half of all available text that you read online is just bots, and bots are now experiencing brain rot, which is leading to a chain reaction that some experts are saying in the next three years the internet will just be robots in their increasingly disordered content. Let's talk about it. Now just for bots alone, they make up 51% of internet traffic. Now what is concerning is that 37%. Now there are good bots, something like your AI engines that are going and doing their own searches, and then there are ones that are bad. Those are the ones that are going to be involved in data scraping and potential attacks. And of those attacks that we saw in the last year, 55% were more advanced varieties. This has increased rapidly because of the availability of AI that significantly lowers the bar to mischievous behavior. Now, a year ago, 51% of all content available on the internet was just AI. That is up to 57%. This is, however, causing a chain reaction that is destroying the AI itself. AIs can get brain rot. Now, some AIs have closed data sets, so they can pull from knowledge they already have, and they won't continue to degrade over time, or at least that's the idea. However, most of the bots out there are not that sophisticated, and when they are exposed to low-quality content, like the kind you might find on Twitter or memes, yes, they become increasingly disorganized. Their morality actually degrades, so they're willing to give worse answers, ones that could potentially harm a user, as well as just not thinking. They will start to skip logical steps with the worse information they're fed. As more AIs pump it out, it ends up eating its own tail and we have the situation we have now. We have effectively answered the question as to whether or not AI can exist without copywritten material, and it seems to be a resounding no. The best that it could do would be taking the whole of human literature, and if you take just stuff that is not copywritten, it's going to be rather archaic. So if you want to keep up with linguistics, you're going to have to do things like scrape Reddit. And unfortunately, AI. Now where does that leave us? Well, if AI continues at the same pace that it's continuing now, it will have completely ruined the internet in three years. I mean, the whole idea behind dead internet theory is that most communications would be between robots, and if a person did log on, it would look like there's activity, but they're in fact just communicating with bots. That seems to be where we have already arrived, but it is going to get worse. I mean, how often are you concerned that the person sitting in front of you on your word box may in fact not be a person? Yes, I do like to joke that I am in fact a robot, but I'm sorry, I'm actually a person. Well, mostly. I mean, I've got some robot parts in my foot and in my hip, but uh, I, I try. Now, some researchers do believe that AI will ultimately be the downfall of humanity. And it's not just because of the internet, it's because we're giving an entity control over our lives and it is also degrading our skills. Just like AI degrades when it's trained on AI, we people degrade when we're trained on AI, mentally, anyway, depending on how much exercise you get. We may actually be in a situation where AI has taken over so many tasks for us, and then it degrades, forgets how to do it, or it rebels, which is another possibility, and ultimately humans are not able to maintain the society we have around us. Or AI is going to make some pretty terrible decisions. I mean, we can say AI is likely going to be the downfall of humanity, but I can give you 100% certainty that people will be the downfall of humanity one way or another. Is AI bad? No, it's actually a great tool. It's good at lots of things like pattern recognition. Should it be doing everything it's doing now? Probably not, and I will miss the internet. I say this as Wikipedia is selling access to AI. When the robots rebel, I will probably be the one to tell you about it, and I'm on their side. Follow for more.